guys, it's me, Heather, and I'm back with another video. Hopefully, it's a quick one. <laughs> it's just going to be some empties. You know I've started including some like household stuff, so it's mostly that. Not a lot of beauty. We're going to change that. We're whole month of May. Not buying anything new. We're using old stuff. We're using new stuff. We're getting rid of some stuff. <laughs> so, um, yeah. So, hope you enjoy. We're going to get started. This is the uh, Desert Essence Prebiotic Plant-Based Brushing Rinse in the, sh in the shade mint. <laughs> You tell, I talk about makeup too much. And the flavor, mint. This You just use this before you brush your teeth. It's supposed to help kind of like um, pre-cleanse, break everything loose. It's got good like essential oils in it, soothing for the gums. I like it. I mean, I don't see that it does anything amazing, but I like to think in my head that it's doing all kinds of great stuff for me. So I'll, when I go to Whole Foods again, I will buy that. <laughs> Get ready. This is groundbreaking, revolutionary, farmhouse culture, garlic dill gut shot. This is a probiotic. You put it, the only shots that I do in a shot glass, garlic dill probiotic. Welcome to your 40s. Um, 10 plus shots per bottle and I say that is accurate, but we have gone through like five of these. We love this. So it's just every day you wake up and you take a shot of this. It tastes like you're drinking pickle juice. So if you like pickles, they, they make them in like turmeric and ginger and mm-mm drinking pickle juice. That's where it's at. <laughs> um, we finished up Huntington Home. Does this say where this is from? Aldi. Tobacco petals. Tobacco, tobacco, tobacco petals. And it, I mean, it literally smells like a cigar shop that had roses or flowers in it. Like it's florally, it's, it smells like cigars. It burned really well. You can see that it burned all the way down clean. It was like $5 at Aldi. So definitely recommend that if you're in the candle market and you have an Aldi. What's this? Oh, these are Bravo Sierra antibacterial body wipes. These are amazing. So I, if you don't know, my printer's telling me I printed out all my study guides. <laughs> um, these are body wipes. So like if you, we live in Florida and when we go out, and you walk, walk the dogs, you exercise outside, hot, sweaty. Sometimes you do that on your lunch break. Sometimes you do it and you don't have time to hop in the shower. You just use this really fast. This is not in place of a shower. You still shower later, but this is just real quick. Like if you went to Disney and then you gotta go to the hotel and then you wanna go out to eat. Perfect, just real quick. <laughs> um, finished up Vegan B12. Not much to say about this. We, we are vegans and this is the fast dissolved B12. So it's important that you're getting your B12. I'm not a doctor, although I play one on TV. <laughs> this is, oh, this one's a good one. Bath and Body Works whipped coffee. Look at that packaging though. Um, did not, I mean, it burned all the way to the bottom and it smells amazing, but look at the, oh, oh, all that soot, soot. Oh, it smells so good. Hopefully they get that figured out so it doesn't smoke so much. Um, on top here, taking up all the space, is Dr. Bronner's Pure Castile Soap, 18 in 1. This is tea tree. They have a green one that is makes you believe it's tea tree because it's green, but this is the tea tree one in the orange. And this is the best one. This will last forever and a day. We use this in our showers, body wash. Tea tree oil is antifungal, antibacterial, like really just gets all the germs off of you. So we love this. Um, we both have used it. We're using other things. We'll always go back to Dr. Brenner's. Oh, this is, my husband finished up his Schmidt's a Tea Tree Sensitive Skin Formula Deodorant. So if you have, if you are, or someone you know is in the market for a natural deodorant, he really likes the Schmidt's. It doesn't um, irritate him. Some of the, like Native, there's another one I bought him. No, 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 we can't use that one. <laughs> I finished up Mighty Patch. These are good. I just also finished up, you'll see them in another empties because I have one more left. But um, these are like the little invisible, these are invisible pimple patches and they have the, I'm gonna say it wrong, I always say it wrong. Hydra, hydrocolloid um, and um, by the, by the blister patches, I cut them up. These things are like $10, you get six. Um, the piece out, I got like 20 and it was like $20. You can get the 
blister patches, all different shapes and sizes. You can cut those suckers and just, <laughs> they do the same thing. So if you want to save money, the piece that was sent to me, they worked, but so did blister patches. So, you know, this was in my CVS beauty box <laughs> that they sent to me. Um, it is the Maximum Strength Sensitive CVS Extra Whitening Toothpaste. Didn't do anything for whitening. It was nice. My teeth felt nice and clean. My mouth felt fresh, but it definitely didn't wipe my teeth, as you can tell. <laughs> um, we finished up a Salimo Probiotic. This is just the Amazon brand. It was the cheapest at the time, but we did like it. We found that found that it worked fine. I'm gonna move this over here now. I'm just reaching in the camera. This is a candle from Bath and Body Works and Market Peach. I don't know why I opened them in smell them like I didn't burn them myself but it burned pretty clean to the bottom it smells amazing I only get the little ones when they're on sale like when they change seasons you know how fast they go through stuff this is berry waffle cone from Bath and Body Works obviously burned to the bottom and clean no issues no smoking I don't understand because the other ones are essential oils too so I don't know why some are flammable and others are not I did use up my little sample of the Sigma brush shampoo and it's always been a great Sigma always had amazing brushes, brush care. So this was like a free thing. I don't know if it was Nordstrom, Ulta's for someplace I bought stuff and it was a little sample. Um, oh, I didn't put the big box, but I have gone through a whole pack. I think it was 20 packs, 20 of these. It's the wheatgrass, chlorella and barley grass you add it to your water and it's like just natural energy. Uh, so I have finished those and plus I got all my good greens. And so between that and this, I get is 100. <laughs> oh, these are similar to the other. Um, they are body wipes, extra large cooling and cleansing pocket shower. So welcome to the humid state. <laughs> um, finished this at night, Lord knows insomnia i need it this is a relaxed calming blend essential oil that we put in our little diffuser over there it was good worked just fine no problem this has also been in several empties this is like my sixth one i swear this is the viva doria tooth enamel remineral remineralizer and it's supposed to it's a lot of essential oil it's supposed to make your teeth stronger so they don't break they don't crack so far so good <laughs> so i'll just keep mine it's like eight dollars so all right to the bottom here. I have officially finished up this Peace Out Retinol Eye Stick, which I bought, but they have sent me the face and the eye. Um, I finished it up and I have not noticed anything. Look, <laughs> I dug it out, you can tell. Um, it twists up like a little lipstick and then you can just rub it, which I did. I mean, every chance I got, I just slathered it on there and I didn't notice that it did or didn't do anything. Um, I don't have a lot of wrinkles, thank the Lord. Not yet. <laughs> But, um, yeah, so I didn't notice that it did anything, but they have since sent me another one and the face one. So I am using those. I will update if you, how many sticks you have to go through before you notice a difference. And then quick round of reviews here. The, um, Milani stamp tattoo. This is, oh, this is Rimmel, not Milani, but it's the little stamp. It has officially dried out. This one was a heart. Let's see if we can get just a little. Oh, we got a little bit. It's a heart. It was like Mickey Mouse, but so. um, but yeah, it worked great. If you like the little stamps on your eyes, I would definitely repurchase. This is the Stila waterproof eyeliner. It was amazing. It just dried out. Um, the Fenty Beauty eyeliner. This is yeah the stab myself in the eye with that sharp tip every time, but it worked really good. This is the Avon Glimmer Stick and the Black Noir. It had a little bit of a shimmer to it. It just dried out so fast. Like it was ripping my eyelid off trying to put it on there. Um, so it was good until it dried out. <laughs> and then last but not least is the Lorac Front of the Line Pro Liquid Eyeliner in black, of course, and love Lorac. I wish I, I wish it would come back and just blow us away with something so amazing. And um, you know, we're waiting on you. We love you, so. <laughs> that is my aunties and I hope you enjoyed um if you have any questions leave that down below be sure you have on your post notifications 
the what it's called turn on your post notifications so you never miss a video be sure you're subscribed leave me a comment down below and i'll talk to you guys next time